Hello, it's Rocky here, and I'm going to show you how to piss off a lot of server, like Facebook page owners. Because nowadays they have been you know, like posting websites, their websites to get money, because they have ads on their websites which are getting the money. And well, this is how to piss them off. So we're on Facebook right now, and. Uh, as you can see my walls are littered with shit like that one's okay but then you see these pages and these pages and anyway so what we're going to do is we're going to open up one of these pages alright so now we're on the page <coughs> this one is kind of annoying if we have a look and if we enable the ads and let's see how many ads that come up it's different every time that you load the page up. It's annoying. He'll be getting about 20 bucks, or 20 cents each click for this. It's got almost 10k likes, and it's a pretty shit thing to do. Now, I'm going to show you how to piss them off, so you don't have to see any of these ads, even though with our block you don't see these ads. You right click, you go, this is for Google Chrome. I imagine it works for Firefox as well. Yeah, you go inspect elements. Now we're down here, this is where it highlights a picture. You'll see a link here. Usually it's the same. Okay, so you clicked it. Now you scroll down and you click on this URL bit here. This is URL. Now you click it again. It's gonna open the picture. And you're gonna be like, oh great, you've done all that just so you can open the picture. Wrong. You get rid of this bit of the URL to the first backslash backspace and then enter let load my internet's terrible now we go we get every single picture that he's ever posted like you see blah, blah, blah. alright so yeah he's not gonna like this at all now you're gonna be like but I don't wanna go through all this and like find which ones I like and which ones I don't like and I don't want to have to spend hours on end going through this well, don't worry so you go back to here this is going to show all the files that he's uploaded uh, two folders now you minimize this and you download this thing called wget it's fairly easy to get you just like download it I'll put download link in the description you open it up extract it I've extracted it to this folder here and then you run the exe this is for Windows and this is the GUI version pretty easy now we press the plus button type in the URL which is this here or copy and paste as I'm doing and now we go to that one wherever you want to save it it's up to you now make sure these are ticked now we go to HTTP and I use Chrome and I like to use Chrome but if it doesn't work with Chrome use a different one or don't select that all it doesn't really matter now with this we go to input and login no wait we go to download make sure that's ticked and that that's ticked yeah that's pretty much and then you go down to this file here now this is the important part, if you don't tick these they won't download at all. Now you tick the top one and these two ones down here, the two, yeah, minor and page, yeah, whatever. Now you save it, you can save it whatever you want, I've saved one as GIF, okay, and then you press OK. And when you press OK, it will start going, start downloading. So now we're downloading, and as you can see down here, it's downloading, downloading. And then you so you can open up if we go to funny let load. See I've done it to quite a few sites. This site's this one here. Oh, Alright nice. See so it's downloading the sites. Now it's downloading multiple of the pictures because if you have a look in the actual files it says this stuff at the end it's just a copy of each picture 
which I don't know right now how to block it. I'm pretty sure there is a way, but for now, you're just going to have to deal with it, delete it manually, or use a different program to, do it, to deal with it. Alright, so it will download from both of these files, and this one too, every single thing. So it's pretty handy, and this will obviously piss off the owner a lot. Now, what I do usually is I copy this link up here, and I go back to the Facebook page, and I post it here, and I say, "Fuck you and your ads." This is why we just. This is. How you get the pictures without getting ads. And I'm not an Xbox fanboy, I'm just doing it to this site because I'm sick of this Facebook page game money. And usually uh, after this you'd post a video of this video. But yeah. So let it load, my internet's terrible. And you'll see that that link will turn blue and you know that's how it goes that's Facebook so now the owner will see that and I'll either fix it or other people will exploit this method and get all their pictures that they've obviously made and copyrighted which most of them haven't now there is a few exceptions so let's go to this one here this site here, yeah, it looks good, it's, well, it doesn't look good, but you know, you can't, you can do inspect elements. So if you can't do inspect elements on the site, just press F12. Fairly simple, and then you go to elements. Now, it's going to not show the whole pack. You're not going to be able to just click the image straight away. So that's why you go to the highlighted areas. So you highlight your like hover your mouse over the certain line and it'll highlight the area that's doing it. So see that one's over here where the ad is? What we don't want that. We want this one over here. Then we down click that one, down click it again, and then we down click it again. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta down click it a lot. So you down click it again. And here it is. It usually says uploads in the link, not always. And then yeah. Now, you've done the picture, you've got the picture, which is all good. And now, you got to backspace this bit here, and then you're going to find out it says 404. Which might not happen on other browsers, so that's why you bring it up to here. It's already set. Set your GIF. Now let's have a look at this. Let's open it up in Windows 8 and see if it works. Now, nah, same 404. So let's edit this. And Windows, Firefox. 404. So most people, well not most sites, but I reckon about 60% of sites block this. And most sites are just dumb. That they need to learn how to block all this kind of stuff from happening. They're idiots and well, yeah, that's basically it. No, looks like this site's pretty much blocked it from us. So if this happens, most of the time you just skip it. But if you really want the site, you can go through all this and try and find a browser that might not block it. Uh, no. Did I pick Safari before? I think I did, but we'll go again. Yeah, so it's useless. we we'll just remove it at the end. Now, if you just want pictures and you don't care about these Facebook sites and you're like, oh, I just want pictures, go to, type in index of, and then type in GIF. Now, that's for GIFs, you can do JPEGs. Now, this will show insecure sites that already have messed up and, you know, the just, you can already get to the index. Maybe they allowed it, maybe they didn't. You know, it's up to them. You see, lovely pictures. Of stuff. 
Some of them look a bit different. Doesn't matter. Should all work. These are pretty bad gifts. <laughs> uh, that's what you're gonna say. <laughs> Just in case there are other people on that shouldn't be seeing that kind of image. Uh, okay, that's chicken in the can. Whatever. Anyway, so you guys get the point. You can do it to any site. Well, not any site. Any site that you can get this index of here. Sometimes you can just do go onto these sites and just do upload, upload and slash. But yeah, so you not. Sometimes it comes up with that. Well, most of the time it will come up with that. So that's why I like doing the inspect elements and stuff because then you don't get mixes ups and stuff. So I hope you learnt something new and find a use for this. Like I hope it's not 100% useless. Alright, see ya.